And Silver Claw surges into the lead. What an upset! I think this is the most exciting race Crawfish Week has ever seen! Crawfish? What, with the sharks busy? But wait, it looks like Scuttle Tail has found her second wind. Yes, she has! <laughs> You're actually enjoying this? <laughs> Old mustachioed intruder, trespassing is against the law. Curses foiled again. Cody? <laughs> What's with the mustache? I'm practicing for my school play. I have the role of the villain. Bad news, Bruce. But you are neither a villain nor a Bruce. You are a Cody Burns. I'm pretending. Using my imagination? You know, for fun. I fail to see the good in falsifying one's identity. Sometimes police do it on TV shows. They catch more bad guys when they go undercover. Uh, maybe these detective movies will help you understand, Chase. Hustle up, team. There's been a break-in at the museum. Aw, oh, now we won't know who wins. Let's go, Boulder. Careful, bro. You drop that rock and our plane will be trashed. I'm pretty sure, bro. It already is. Evan and Miles, hands in the air. Why stop with our hands, Chief? <laughs> Guess you didn't hear about Doc's new anti-theft system. In there, hack that. A routine patrol with four bats and stasis. He's a hook in the strangest of places. Earth was their home now, and in addition, Optimus Prime gave them this mission. Learn from the human, serve and protect. Live in their world, earn their respect. Much to handle. <laughs> I'm really glad only one of them speaks. visual on where Evan and Miles went? No, I think they're jamming the camera feed, Dad. Danny, see if you can spot those thieves from the sky. <laughs> Cade, check the roads. We'll catch up once we find out exactly what was stolen. Not much, Dad. All they took was a chunk of mechanite. It's pretty, but it's not rare or worth anything. Usually Evan and Miles have more expensive taste. Maybe we scared them off before they got anything good. They're up to something. I just wish I knew what it was. YOLO, bro. Time to give this glorified rock a test drive. <laughs> Red means go. <laughs> Looks like our tech racker works. And that means anything with circuits won't. Let's go, Chase. 
It's the perfect night for training maneuvers. No, thank you. I am currently studying these informative motion pictures Cody provided me with. You're watching movies. I'm conducting research. Whatever you want to call it. I was an island of law, afloat in an ocean of crime waves. I'd been undercover for so long, my own chief didn't recognize me. It was worth it, if it meant blowing the lid off the biggest crime spree in Cincinnati. Undercover? I believe now I understand. Do you guys know where Chase is? Haven't seen him all morning. I thought if he practiced my script with me, he'd see why pretending so fun. First, you might have to explain to him what fun means. The air was heavy, heavy with the fog of lawlessness. That's when she walked in and asked me the one question I wasn't prepared to answer. Why is it so dark in here? Chase, is there a reason you're in here with the lights off? I am using my imagination to expand my law enforcement tactics. Yeah, okay, and where'd you get the hat? My life is full of mysteries. The internet. Apparently one size really does fit all. Whoa! I think someone's trying to hijack Huxley's broadcast! And what safety techniques should we be aware of, Mayor? Well, if you ever see an unattended crawfish, you should immediately... Wait, cut! Something's wrong with my newsfeed. Hey! Who are they? No, stop! Wait! <laughs> Guess Evan and Miles don't like crawfish weak either. Cody, keep an eye on those two from the command center. Team? Rescue bots, roll to the rescue! The sound of my squealing tires echoed across the landscape. Chase, are you narrating? I'm using my imagination to stay in character. Filmic evidence shows this behavior is 99.8% effective when solving crimes. If it means catching Evan and Miles, I'm all for it. Dad, Evan and Miles are about to drive off with Huxley's satellite dish. What do they need that for? Maybe they want to watch the Peps on Ice marathon. I doubt it's that innocent, Blades. I'd give anything to know exactly what those two are planning. Hmm. Dad, they're on Russell Street. You can cut them off on first. You heard Cody, team. Form a roadblock. Chase and I will sneak up from behind. And in case we're not enough of a threat, this tripwire will be. Think they can use Chase as a getaway car? <laughs> Can't wait to see this. Any second now, Chase will slam on the brakes. Any second. Or not. Where's he going? Chief, do something! Chase is the victim of Grand Theft Autobot! But Blades, nobody can make you bots do what you don't want to do. Trust me, I've tried. You think Chase wanted to go with Evan and Miles for some reason? He has been acting weird lately. I haven't noticed anything. His optics were clear, his spark pulse normal. There's an easy way to find out. Police robot, report your 20. Chase is ignoring the chief? Or more likely, he doesn't want to reveal his identity in front of those thieves. Dad, Chase just drove into a zone where the cameras are down. He must have some kind of plan. If he had a plan, he would have run it by me first. Maybe it's a secret plan? Uh, the chase I know would never go rogue on a mission. Something's not right. Stealing a police car? Chief Burns just got Chief Burned. Let's take this baby outside and hook her up to Big Mama. 
Police log, undercover mission. Something tells me these two mugs are cooking up a plan so big they'll need an extra chili pot. I need to report their exact plan back to my chief. So I'm sticking around until I find out what they're serving for dessert. If X marks the spot, these goons are tic-tac-toeing their way to Doc's lab. Chief, chase reporting in. Communications are blocked. My calm is as useless as swim trunks in a sandbox. But maybe outside I- Hey! Hold it right there, robot. Where do you think you're going? Awaiting input. Nice! Check it out, bro. This hunk of junk has to do anything we say. Hey, cop bot. Change into a car. Now back to a robot. Hop on one foot. Do push-ups. Now act like a chicken. <laughs> huh? Oh, you're evil, bro. Okay, robot. Repeat after me. Evan and Miles rule. The Burns is just drool. Evan and Miles rule. The Burns is just drool. <laughs> yeah. New orders, gear brain. Steal us some floatium from the lab. I said, move it. It's too perfect. Robo Dude takes the fall for us, and we get what we need to finish our rockin' plan. Police log, undercover mission. I knew I was in deep, but Chief needed to know what these leeches had planned. So I had to go deeper. It was time to take off my swimmings. Down, Drex. Good boy. Floatium in its pure form can make anything fly. But how does that fit into the plan? I can't believe you made it past security. Change into a car, robot. We're keeping you around. Police box. Stand down. Why don't you tell Chief Burns what we taught you to say? Do it, robot. Evan and Miles rule. The Burns is just drool. Did Chase just insult us? <laughs> I can serve you more efficiently if you inform me of your overall plan. The plan is get us out of here. Now! Power up and energize! Whoa, what just happened? I don't think Chase likes us anymore. He's not getting away that easy. Heatwave, think. There must be a good explanation for Chase's behavior. He'd never turn on us intentionally. Um, hi, Dad. Did you not just see the same thing we all did? You wouldn't be the first Cybertronian to change sides. Cody, where's Chase headed? The camera's fuzzing out again. Must be his new partner's doing. Heatwave, I think Chase is still on our side. Cody, why's that, son? Well, when Chase called you a name, he didn't use his real voice. He's still acting like he's a robot. I think he's undercover, like in the detective movies I gave him. Could be. Back to the firehouse, team. We're not giving up on Chase yet. Even if he already gave up on us? Police log, undercover mission. Letting my partners down was harder than a jawbreaker in winter. But it had to be done to uncover this duo's exact plan. Ah, cool story, bro. Needs more floatium. Oh, almost forgot to shield our stuff. Stay inside the green light, robot. Unless you want to get fried like all the other tech in town. Griffin Rock's going back to the Stone Age. We're going shopping.
Heat wave, come in. Emergency. Exclamation of frustration. The signal is still blocked. And I can't enter that red zone without shutting down. Hmm. Chase will come back. You'll see. And if he doesn't, we can get Bumblebee to join the team. Cade, not helping. <sighs> Danny's been getting calls about a strange red light outside. Anybody want to go take a look? Yeah, uh, sounds great, Dad. But I'm about to be Graham's high score. Call me if you need me. Evident miles on the loose, and a mysterious red light. Something tells me it's not a coincidence. Whoever's behind it is getting closer. Attention, rescue bots. You must avoid the red beam at all costs. That's Chase. See, I knew we wouldn't abandon the team. What's to say this isn't a trap? It seems strange to be warning you if he was trying to trap you. Uh, guys, he isn't slowing down. What are you doing? Get off! Negative. This force field is the only thing that can protect us from the tech wrecker device. Tech wrecker? Is that what's causing the beam? Yes. Evan and Miles' true plan. Let me explain. Oh, yeah! High score! Graham is so owned! Huh? What? Wait! <gasps> So, as Cody advised, I used my imagination to go undercover. We never really doubted you, Chase. Right, Heatwave? Wrong. Running off like that endangers all of us. Plus, we missed you. There'll be time to work all this out later. Right now, we have to see what damage that beam did. And stop Evan and Miles. But how? No tech, remember? Yeah, our comms won't even work. And if the bots have to stay under that shield, they won't be much help. Then we'll have to get creative. Okay, who forgot to pay the electricity bill? Nice haul, bro. Let's get more. Dad, I haven't ridden one of these things in years. You'll get lots of practice by the time we reach downtown. <sighs> Fine. So, we're just gonna wait here while there are people that need saving? Perhaps we can assist in another way, by destroying the source of the problem. How are we supposed to do anything under this? There's not even enough room to transform. Huh. Ah. Wait, what? Your okay, it's not working. Ah. Ugh. All right, rescue bots, walk to the rescue. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Uh, careful, Mr. Harrison. Have you ever considered walking to work? All clear, Cody. Dad, look! Roadblock, team. Chill, bro. They're nothing without their robot butlers. <laughs> Some of us can still kick it old school. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. <sighs> well. That was humiliating. I thought it showed teamwork. The real challenge will be accessing the tech wrecker. I'll just fly up there and... Oh, right. The shield. Evan and Miles put that device in the sky. Perhaps if we imagined we were villains like them, we could think of a solution. That's the dumbest thing I've... Hello, I'm Miles. I love to steal. 
<laughs> I'm like Evan, because I'm not saying anything. Oh, come on, pretending doesn't help. If I was a villain, I'd think of a million better things to do with Floatium than... The Floatium! And I just unproved my point, huh? Prepare for liftoff. Oh, this is ridiculous. Actually, flying's not so bad with all of you here. We did it! Good job, out time. Outstanding. Imagination is clearly a useful tool in rescue operations. Hope that means you've thought of a way for us to get back down. And like a swimming pool in winter, the case was closed. Who are you talking to? Your spark was in the right place, Chase. But in the future, share your plan with the team. Understood. Would you care to hear my current plan? Care for an honest answer. Cody and I will be practicing for his school play. Fortunately, I will be playing the good guy. I find my imagination has been stretched enough for one day. 